So here are the ordering options for the NC Connect. So the base system comes with your router, the cloud wings or angel wings antenna, and a 15 foot data cable that goes from the router to the cloud wings or angel wings antenna. Now the first option below is the antenna type. So it comes base with the cloud wings or on our 4G system it comes with the angel wings antenna. You can select the binocular antenna as well. So this is our 5G directional binocular antenna. And what I tell people is this is a great omnidirectional antenna. You can install on the roof of your RV and it'll pretty much get you a signal, I would say 90% of the places that you go. If you ever go places like state parks, national parks, or way out in the fringe zones, you may want to consider purchasing our directional antenna. And as you can see, it is a little larger, but these antennas can pick up just about a whisper of a signal. So having this kit right here with the omnidirectional antenna along with our directional antenna, can pretty much get you covered just about anywhere. So if you're an RV or a traveler, you may want to consider picking up both the cloud wings and the binoculars. If you are off grid or you're not going to be moving, you may want to consider just purchasing the binoculars antenna because this is a directional antenna that you can essentially uh, set it and forget it. So if you never move, you may not need the omnidirectional, but the, the directional may be a good option for you. Now the next option is the data cable and our system comes with a 15 foot data cable. Uh, on the 5G, it is a 15 foot USB USB A to C cable. On our 4G, it's a USB A to A cable. Now you have a couple different options. With the 5G, you can do a 30 foot USB A to C. And then you can also do a 15 foot USB A to C with a USB C to C extension cable. So the important thing to note here is that you can have a maximum of 30 feet from the router to the antenna system. So a good use case is with the standard 15 foot cable, you can go from the router to the antenna and possibly install it up on your roof. And if you ever want to do the binoculars, you can essentially unplug from the roof and then hook up the extension cable and go from here to the binoculars a little bit higher. I have a video on YouTube about how to do that. But basically the important part is that you have a maximum of 30 feet from the router to the antenna. Now the next option is our mount post. So this mount post is for the cloud wings antenna. This allows you to mount it on a flat surface like on uh, the roof of your RV or some people will mount this on a vehicle and this matches up to the cloud wings like this. We also send you out a couple zip ties that you can use to attach it to the mount post. We decided to make this optional because we have a round pull flange here on the back of the cloud wings and the 4G angel wings that allow you to match this up. So if you have like a flag pole that you use already, you can mount it up to anything about one inch to two inches that mounts up pretty nicely. Some people put this on the ladder of their RV as well. But what I say is when in doubt to go ahead and order the mount post because it is nice to have and it does give you a good option to mount it to anything flat. The last option we have available is our InstiLink data plan. This is a plan that we offer uh, that we can ship directly to you so that you can use directly in the NC Connect. We specialize in having a high priority data plan, which means when you get to places uh, where there's lots of campers out there and they are all using cellular internet, having a high priority data plan will matter so you can get data in places where other people won't. Essentially, it'll put you to the top of the list of the people that can stream, do Zoom calls, everything like that. So if you need a great data plan with high availability for data and essentially be on a plateau where nobody else can be, then check out our NC-Link data plans. You can see the pricing and the different options down in the section below. If you have any questions on this ordering process, feel free to reach out by going to ncconnect.com, go to help and then contact us and just shoot us in a message and we'll be glad to help. Thank you so much.